Oh my god, that alpaca just gave birth. Oh, the little tiny baby. Nicole sent me a message saying, turn right at the fork by the yellow vest. Is this a goddamn escape room? What are we doing? Hi, I'm Montana Dana, and in today's episode of Girl vs. Van, I make friends with all the wildlife, come up with a million dollar idea, which is Invisalign for alpacas. And can someone call this alpaca an Uber? I will be your DD girl. Get home safe. Subscribe for Monday through Friday videos. Good morning from Mount Hood. I know you've seen this view before. I have too, and I'm not tired of it yet. Check it. It's so pretty. Ooh, it is very smoky this morning. But why though? Another beautiful day. I'm taking off right away this morning, because one, I don't have any water to make coffee. I don't think you wish to see me without coffee. No, it's just part of my morning routine. I'm not that cranky if I don't have coffee. Or am I? So we're going to Mount Hood Roasters, and then we're heading down to Bend, Oregon. So I gotta get my audiobook on fleek. I actually really like driving. I just put on a good audiobook and go, and it's super entertaining. Make myself a beverage bar, I have some road snacks. It's all groovy, baby. I like trick my mind into thinking we're having fun. We're not driving. We're just improving our mental health and eating delicious snacks. That's what we're doing. I need to dump my garbage. I need to get water. I need to do all sorts of stuff, but it looks like Ben has a Planet Fitness. I think it has a Starbucks. I think we'll be good in Bend, Oregon, because I'm gonna be there for about a week, I think. I don't know, we're gonna suss it out. There's this big van life get together and it starts next Thursday. Today is Sunday. I'm gonna go pre-party with the van peeps and then decide if I wanna spend 150 to $200 on the actual event. I've been all around the world oh, Every city, every place I just made a new friend, Bernadette, over here. I got a door swipe and she was like, she was feeling me. Look at her tail wagon. Longhorn, something or others. Are these, these are cows, right? Who are you? What are you? Turning around, because I saw a little farm. I think they were like little llamas or emus or something. I don't know, but they're cute. And there are a bunch of baby ones. So we are turning around. We gotta go see that shit. Gotta go see it. Goodbye, Bernadette, I love you. I actually really did like that cow. Hi. Oh, hello. <laughs> Sorry, Bernadette, you are just fine. Oh, they're alpacas. Look at these things. Oh my god. Oh my god, how cute are they? I can't with how cute you are, guys. I just can't. Look at these little babies. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't. I want one. I never knew I needed an alpaca pet, but today I know. Oh my god, they're cute. Um, hell yes, we are going to feed some alpacas right now. Yes, we are doing that. Woo! I was getting a door swipe and the sprinkler sprayed right in my van. Mac got a little bath. Don't run away. I want to come feed you. Oh, look at their fuzzy little legs. I want to pet the baby alpacas. Oh my God. Why are you so cute? Got our alpaca food. I'm gonna go find the babies. You give me the cold shoulder, dude? Is that what you're doing? Oh my God, Diggles. It diggles. Oh my god, that alpaca just gave birth. Oh, the little tiny baby. Look how small it is. Oh, oh my god. She literally just gave birth. Oh my god, I can't with you. Oh, hi. Sweet baby alpaca Jesus. today are sisters from the same mom and the female carries her baby for about 11 and a half months oh wow so it's not that wouldn't be common for that to happen Often, but she must have pooped in you in 
An hour later, I still have not fed the alpacas. I was too busy watching this mother give birth. Hello, friend. Oh my god, that dimples. That dimples. You are cute. Oh, are you teeth? Oh my gosh, you're cute. I feel bad for this girl. She's got blood on her. Are you sleepy, alpaca? Do you want some food, honey? Do you want some food, honey? No. Just need to rest. You had a rough day, Missy. Is she like crying? She's making like little whimpering sounds. Does she have twins? It's okay, Mama. Are you sure you don't have twins in there, girl? What is going on? I love you. Girl needs a bath and a cuddle. Where is your husband, girl? He should be spooning you or at least changing diapers. I mean, baby's over there just party and hearty. I love you. Alpaca! Hey, alpaca! Tipsy alpaca! Tripsy alpaca! Boozy alpaca! 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 Stoic alpaca! Mini alpaca! Fuzzy alpaca! Llama alpaca! Hungry alpacas! Baby alpaca! More baby alpacas! Intoxicated alpaca! Over the legal limit alpaca! One too many shots alpaca! I'm tired and I just gave birth alpaca! Panda alpaca! Baywatch alpaca! 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 Baby's first steps, alpaca! Ah. Oh, excuse you. Stinky alpaca! Greedy alpaca! Sister wives, alpacas! Al grandpa! Albino! Escape artist, alpaca! Underbite, alpaca! Alblaca! Alpaca! Inebriated, alpaca! Can I see your ID, alpaca? Go home, alpaca! You're drunk! Single and locking alpaca! Statue, alpaca! 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 Where is this child's father, alpaca? Sassy alpaca! Grumpy alpaca! 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 Neglectful parent alpaca! He probably thinks that they are the, his mommy now. Girl! Go take care of your child, girl! She's a sleepy mama! Well, I guess they're not afraid of humans, so... So my day is made. It's only noon and I saw an alpaca give birth. They're the cutest little things I've ever seen. They're like llamas, but more fuzzy and more cute. Heading to Bend, Oregon. This is Crescent Moon Ranch, if anyone's interested. <laughs> Panda Express for lunch. So annoying when these places are closed because you have to go through the drive-thru and Macintosh does not fit 
through the drive-thru. So we're walking through the drive-thru like an asshole. At least we're getting steps in, right? Kutcher, I just got pumped. A smooth road in van life? Oh, no, nope, there it is. Oh, there it is. There, the, there's the washboard roads. Washboard or die. Almost there, baby. Um, but seriously, though, am I getting pumped? I do not see anybody. Seriously, are they f***ing with me? There's no turn off. I see people on the other side, but I don't know how to get over there. Um, hello? My navigation stopped as well. So we're going back the other direction. Van life is so much fun. I love it. We're gonna drive back to get navigation and then try it again. Okay, we're turning around again. We're flipping a Yui. Nicole sent me a message saying, turn right at the fork by the yellow vest. Whatever the f that means. I guess we're gonna try that then. Or maybe I just didn't go far enough, but I don't have navigation. So we are looking for a fork with a yellow vest to turn right at. Let's try this again. Is this a goddamn escape room? What are we doing? Welcome to nature escape rooms. How not to die in the forest. We are looking for a fork and a yellow vest. We are turning right and that is what we're doing. Oop, I'm pretty sure there's blood on those trees. That was definitely blood. I'm not seeing a fork yet. We're way past the, the pin drop. Oh, all right, there, there, okay. We have plenty of gas, it's okay. My check brake pad light came on though. Um, all right, well how far exactly do we wanna go down this windy road? I'm not seeing a fork or a yellow vest. I'm seeing neither one of those. I am seeing a dead end, AKA a roundabout. Ew, we're just lost in the middle of the of Egypt. I saw no yellow vest. I saw no forks or spoons or knives in the road. Oh, fuck. All right, am I supposed to drive up this thing? No, I am, I'm not doing that, Nicole. I am not. Nicole is gonna have a word. I'm going to have a word with Nicole later. Just kidding, you can't have a word with Nicole. She is like <laughs> the sweetest person. I guess we go back and navigate and then ask Nicole like what the fuck, Nicole? Is that a fork in the road? Hello, anybody out here? Well, I failed in the escape room. I see pe I see like lights over there. How do I get to you? We're looking for a fork. I would even take a fork at this this point. I don't know. Holy f oh, there's the yellow vest. I see it. Suck it in, Mac. Oh my gosh, good job. Okay, am I winning at escape rooms? Wilderness edition? Okay. All right, okay. Yay, I see vans. Let's see if I recognize anybody. I guess there's gonna be a really big group. Very excited about it. There's Nicole's van. Ooh, there's a cute little sprinter like mine. There's a lot of people here I don't. Is that, is that Kyle travel style? I think that's Kyle Travel Style. I'm not entirely sure, but I think it is. Oh my God. I did not know Kyle Travel Style was gonna be here. Holy shit. How very exciting. All right, we just hung out for the last couple hours. I didn't really vlog any of it because it was pitch black out there. I had a good day. I ran into my friends, Erica, Nicole, Drew, and Travel Kyle Styles. So we'll hang out with them tomorrow. But if you made it this far in the video, comment alpaca down in the description. Am I saying that right? Alpaca, alpaca, alpaca. Packa. It's midnight. I don't have the words. <laughs> but if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, share it with your friends. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow on Girl vs. Van, I run into another van life musician, meet new friends, and play inappropriate party games. And I found a wild Kyle in his natural habitat. See you tomorrow.